How long have you been putting on exhibitions? This is the seventh year. And the reason, shall I tell you the reason? Well, my son is, my grandson is now seven years, and when he was born, he had a tracheostomy, which I'd never even heard about. And he was in the RVI for a year, and uh, he was very, very ill, so I wanted to raise some money. And this was the one thing I thought, oh, I know something about, a little bit about, not something, a little bit about. And we put an exhibition on. It's a lot, lot of hard work. But it's been lovely, and I hope everybody that's seen it this year has thoroughly, thoroughly enjoyed it. And the girls that have done the work are just amazing, absolutely amazing. Well, this year, it's the first time we've ever charged an entrance fee. And we've just let people come in, and it's been the best thing that we could have ever done. And we've raised, in a, up to, in one day, we've raised over £2,000. We've never reached that before, and that's for charity. And for the two charities we've chosen this year are the Salvation Army and the Durham Air Cadets. And the Air Cadets came yesterday, and they were absolutely priceless going around talking to people and, and mingling and, and helping, and it was just amazing. And the, the Salvation Army came, and they played for an hour. They had the band outside, and fortunately the, the rain stayed off. So that was lovely. Made a nice atmosphere. And who can exhibit their clothes? It's girls that have come to the classes and the workshops, um, or one or two if people have bought the fabrics, if they're regular customers here, and maybe they've done them at home, but it's fabrics from our shop. Well, one of the main reasons I think we do it now is to inspire people and encourage people to start and quilt or even sew because they're not all quilts, there are wall hangings and Christmas decorations. It's not a craft, we don't promote um, like crafty things, but it, quilting's a craft obviously. And, and we just would like to encourage people and from all walks of life, people say, oh I couldn't do that, but they can, you know, and everybody's at different levels and everybody works at different speeds, but, um, and everybody likes different colours as you can see by the exhibition. Um, and different designs, and it's, it's quite arty in a way, you know, quilting, in my opinion. And on a final note, can I just thank everyone who has supported us, that have come along to the exhibition, and to people who are not involved in the, um, the Quilters Cupboard, um, for coming and giving up the time, uh, for doing various things, working in the kitchen, um, a son, it has been amazing this year, helping to hang, and all these women around isn't easy for a young man. <laughs> um, and the teachers who've encouraged the, the pupils to, um, to exhibit the work and to push them on a little bit to get things finished. It's been a combination of everything. So I just want to say thank you to everyone who's contributed the time for this, towards this exhibition. It isn't my exhibition. Maybe I try and encourage people, but it isn't Rita Walker's exhibition. It's an, under an umbrella of the Quilters Cupboard. Come and visit us at the Quilters Cupboard, Lear Group, Suite 2 Little Burn Industrial Estate, Langley Moor, Durham, DH78HG. For further information, call 01913 781 or 01913 867 007.